Getting medical marijuana from the dispensary to the front door just got a lot easier for San Francisco residents thanks to a new startup. But is it as smoking as everyone's saying? Ease, with a Z obviously, is a new startup that aims to give users a professional delivery service for their medical marijuana, with customers ordering online and Ease bringing it to their doorstep. The startup is already being billed as the Uber of pot, referencing the popular startup car service, and local publications have run with it. But the only things Ease seems to have in common with Uber are it's based online and involves cars, just like most delivery services. So what does that even mean? As the Washington Post points out, it's worth noting that many, if not most, of the Uber of whatever descriptions originate from the Uberish companies themselves. Of course they do. Uber parallels are good for funding pitches. And many outlets have been more than happy to run with those prefab comparisons, no matter how meaningless they might actually be, with a couple big repeat offenders. It's like trying to be the Uber of hospitality. Right. Now with a startup pegged as the Uber of house cleaning and handyman. The one company known as the Uber of jets. The Uber of wine. The Uber of bouncers. But calling something the blank of blank is far from a new phenomenon, especially in the tech sector. Just in the past couple of months, the startup world has brought us the Twitter of radio and the Twitter of messaging. That's in addition to the Facebook of homes, the Facebook of neighborhoods, and just the general Facebook of real estate. And before there was Facebook or Twitter, tech companies had to settle for being the Google of things, even when it came to spit, blood, or garbage. But Ease can't necessarily stake a loan claim on being the Uber of pot, because another online medical marijuana delivery company called Grasp is already claiming to be the original Uber of pot. Either way, Ease is so far only available to use through its website, with an app expected to launch later this week. For Newsy, I'm Sebastian Martinez.